Hey, welcome to the to the face reveal video as promised. Well, not even really as promised. I mean, I don't know where this whole stigma came from, maybe from this definition here, which I had no part in writing and nor is any of it true. I do suck a lot of d but that's not true. I, of course, bought the mug that had the definition written it, written on it because I thought it was so hilarious. I don't even remember promising a face reveal. I don't think I ever did. If someone could prove me wrong, good shit. I think the closest thing I've done to promise a face reveal video is my, in my 200k Q&A special, which I'll play right here. Not yet. Maybe, perhaps, possibly a face reveal at a larger milestone. We'll see. Not a promise. I never said promise. I said maybe, perhaps a bunch of times. It wasn't confirmed. Y'all won't shut up about it, so here we are. <laughs> I also just want to point out that with this face reveal, none of my content is going to change. It's going to open some avenues maybe for future videos. Like, I'm not going to start daily vlogging or putting face cams in my video. I'm not about that. That's not... What my content is based around now obviously i know for some of you you like to keep sort of the fourth wall intact so if you don't want to see my face don't watch this video if you want to still envision me as the milk bag i am the milk bag i always will be i am on the inside outside everything i am what embodies the milk bag. But as a warning right now, I'm letting you know ahead of time, if you don't want to break that fourth wall, I'm giving you the option now, click off the video and stuff, and don't complain to me later when you see my face and it's not what you're expecting, okay? It's nothing special. Now, let's get down to business. With my face, it's always been a kind of inside joke to me. Not even inside, it's quite obvious. I've said it multiple times. I don't give a shit if you guys know what I look like. It is so easy, and I, I mean so easy to find my face currently. I never thought a face reveal was necessary, but since I just want to kind of get it over with, because apparently it's a, it's a standard nowadays. So instead of doing the classic sit in front of a webcam, hey, this is me kind of video, I'm, that's boring. That's, that's boring. Throw that right off the table. Just fucking slide it off the table. It's gone. Fuck that idea. We're doing it different. We're doing it my way. I am going to show you guys every time you had the chance to see my face and possibly missed it, seen it, didn't think about it. It's been there all along. You just had to think about it. So yeah, I guess let's get started. This was the first of many pictures leaked by my good friend, Cryos Gaming. <laughs> Hashtag blame Cryos. I unfortunately don't have a screenshot of the tweet seeing as he deleted it because he felt bad after realizing that he didn't mean to tag me in the photo that he posted. <laughs> then I claimed I wasn't friends with him anymore because of it, and then I quickly responded with JK, I don't give a fuck that he posted it. This one, you need to go a little bit CSI mode, but my face can, can be seen for a single frame because John forgot to edit it out of Gold Gloves vlog one time. He tweeted out again, threatening to leak my face for a third time if he got a thousand favorites on that tweet. And what do you know it? He got a thousand favorites on that tweet and then he tweeted out my face. It was up there for such a short time, I didn't, I didn't even manage to screenshot it. <laughs> Here's the thousand person to like that tweet from John, only to be oblivious to the fact that someone actually responded with a picture of my face in his screenshot. There I am in the back of I'm Cody's tweet, looking like I've seen something I shouldn't have seen. Both me and Tyler took pictures with the same fan and then that fan tweeted at the both of us and then Tyler retweeted tweeted it without thinking, knowing that my face was in it. <laughs> Here's my face, heavily edited by Snapchat filters that I replied to Minnie with. Then Minnie responds with a gif of the fancy people clapping, knowing full well that I've just posted my face without anybody knowing it. Here's my face, once again, heavily edited by Snapchat filters in the middle of Dahi Denogo's video. My own Cards Against Humanity video where we brought in the topic of someone bringing a shirt that said unedited Dahi Denogla videos. Oh wait, who's that in the back? Here I am in the backseat of an SUV in Jobless Garrett's vlog. Mini Lads Tennessee vlog, this one's by far my favorite, seeing as every time my face was shown, I got a tweet for it. Something along the lines of, Smitty, did you know that Mini Lad leaked your face? No, I had no idea. In my video titled The Smitty Rant, you can see that for a split second, my face is clearly in this video, and yes, I did it on purpose. And finally, one of my favorite photos of all time, it is my face face swapped with Snapchat onto I Am Wildcat's body, and I've even been using the original and variations of the picture itself as my Steam profile picture for like the last two months. And hell, you can even just Google Smitty face reveal and you know you'll 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 come across it well there you have it there's the face reveal hopefully you aren't disappointed hopefully you are disappointed because i know a lot of people will be thank you so much for watching the video hopefully you did enjoy and huge shout out to my actor my body actor i really appreciate it man thanks for attending all those events for me this turned out to be a really good joke uh you'll receive your payment soon you guys didn't actually think i'd do a face reveal right like i'm a milk bag <laughs>